Hey everybody, it's your boy Dino Dean. And the first lady of food, Miss Coretta. And, and we're, we're the, the Black, Black Foodies. Foodies. Today we are on the south side of Chicago in the South Shore area and guys we are at Give Me Some Sugar Bakery and Cafe guys. They have some sugar, they have some savory. We're going to go check them out right now guys and get ready for the potato chip cookies. Ready Miss Coretta? I'm ready. Let's go get it. Hi my name is Lenore Lindsay. Uh, the name of my uh, bakery is Give Me Some Sugar. You know it's been here for 10 years. Um, my big deal things here are potato chip cookies and anything that is lime. Key lime pie, lime parfaits, and we don't just have sweets, we have savory goodies as well. Um, I make a fabulous chicken pot pie. We also have uh, soups every day. And when you come to my place, butter is not the enemy. It makes everything better. All right, I am feeling like a princess today here in Give Me Some Sugar. And I have the quiche special served on this beautiful platter. I have the spinach quiche, scones, which are savory scones, and there are turkey sausages, which are made in-house. So let me go ahead and dig in. I want to try a piece of this turkey sausage first. I love turkey sausages. Mm. Okay. Made in house, very good. I taste the nice rich spices in here. This is good. All right, now I make a good quiche, but this here just looks appealing. I mean, look at this, beautiful. It looks like a little muffin. Gorgeous. Look at that. All that spinach and cheese and this beautiful looking golden crust. Wow, I simply love it. The crust is nice and buttery. The spinach, mm, so rich. And the cheese is just setting it off. This is an excellent quiche, love it. All right, on to the scone. This is so good. I just always love scones with like a cup of tea or coffee. Like I said, I feel like a princess today. savory scone is so flaky and good. It's like a biscuit, but it's just a little bit more denser. So, and then it has chives and cheese and turkey sausage inside. So, you know, I just got a plate of heaven right here. Delicious. And guys, I'm about to try the savory here at Give Me Some Sugar. And it is the chicken pot pie. And it's not the traditional pot pie. It doesn't have a crust over the top she dolloped a fantastic biscuit on top guys just take a look at that i can't wait to try this very unique i've never seen that before but i'm going to start off with the bottom first to be honest with you i want to get straight to this yard bird oh my goodness. <laughs> the first thing i noticed out of everything is the black pepper it just comes through and I'm a sucker for black pepper. It's not too prominent, but just absolutely on point. And the chicken is succulent and moist. And it's very creamy. You have peas, carrots. Look at the steam coming off of that, guys. This is sensational. Mm. Now I'm gonna try a bit of this biscuit with it. She just 
shut it down with this, guys. This biscuit is so moist, so buttery. Absolutely spectacular, guys. Man. Mm. Some sweet, some savory. Better come on down here and get it in, guys. She got it going on. Miss Lindsay is an absolute genius. And guys, after that phenomenal chicken pot pie, I'm moving over to something a little bit more sweet. Guys, the lime bars I hear are absolutely phenomenal. And I love key lime pie, so I'm sure I'm gonna love these. Let's give it a go. Mm. <laughs> this just makes you feel all warm and fuzzy inside, guys. The crust is absolutely spectacular. Graham cracker crust and the lime filling on top. Absolutely splendid, guys. Tart, not too sweet, and all the way on point, guys. I feel like taking these hostages and not giving Miss Coretta any, but you gotta share. <laughs> Make your way on down here to give me some sugar. Absolutely spectacular. Guys, just when I thought the party was over, Miss Lindsay just handed me two of her gourmet lemon cookies. They aren't even on the menu, guys. This is something out the back, out the vault. Guys, I'm gonna sample these right now. Have a look at them. They look absolutely spectacular. All right. Oh, man. These are really good. The cookies are buttery, flaky. It's just like a little lemon Oreo, guys. All the way on point. Ask Miss Lindsay, not on the menu. I ask her to bring them off the vault for you when you come down. Now I heard about this potato chip cookie down here at Give Me Some Sugar, and I had to try it. I mean, a potato chip cookie, come on now. I cannot wait to try this. I'm gonna break it. So it's a butter cookie base with potato chips. And you can see the little chips in here and pecans. Mm. Wow, this will be the first. Okay. Uh, I'm doing the right thing, so just give me one. Wow. Mm. You know, it's like a shortbread cookie with bits of potato chips and pecans. I mean, it's so buttery. It's not too sweet. I mean, I'm getting the saltiness of the potato chips. I mean, this is just simply delicious. It's her signature cookie. Come on and get it. And guys, right now we're going to give you our recap on Give Me Some Sugar Bakery and Cafe. And as you guys know, our ranking system goes off of kisses. One, two, three, four, five being the best. Ready to give me some sugar, Miss Coretta? Of course, honey. One kiss. Two kisses. Three kisses. Four kisses. Five kisses, guys. Give me some sugar. Got it going on here in South Shore, guys. The chicken pot pie was off the chain. The potato chip cookie was off the chain. The scones were off the chain. Everything was absolutely off the chain. Miss Lindsay is an absolute genius. And if you have a restaurant you would like for us to review, email us at theblackfoodies at gmail.com. Theblackfoodies at gmail.com. Everything was just off the chain. <laughs> and with that said, guys, we out of here. One love. Make your way on down here, I promise you. You're in for a great treat. Bye. We out.